Hello everybody, my name is William and welcome back to another Roblox Bee Swarm Simulator video where today I would like to show you guys all the hidden locations for free items like star jellies, royal jellies, glue, coconuts, etc. Enzymes, you know, just whatever, you know, golden eggs actually, golden eggs, or more so golden egg because there's only one. The first one, which is the most simple, is obviously up here on top of the mushroom, there is a royal jelly up here, you can go ahead and collect that. Over here in the bamboo field, up there, you have to do this parkour to get up there so let's just quickly do this once we get up here and right here is a royal jelly and we can go ahead and collect that and then coming over to the blue hq there's a royal jelly right here right there's a royal jelly in there now to get there what you have to do is you gotta come over here to the 10b gate you don't have to go through it so it's okay if you don't have 10 bs you can go over here jump behind the blue hq like right here like right behind it right here and there's this little dark spot and then through this tunnel you just gotta keep going straight after turning right and you'll see there's the royal jelly right there and we can go ahead collect that and that's one of them done and then there's one next to brown bear there's a royal jelly right here it is all the way over here in the clover field and next to the blue hq and next to the commando chicken cave is a royal jelly next to brown bear and then up here in the star hall so if we go over here to the red cannon you can use the the blue cannon right there or no the yellow cannon you can use the yellow cannon to get here but it's just quicker to use the red cannon for me so yeah right here is the royal jelly it is up here next to the star hall and then right here in the ant area next to the hives there is a ticket and it is right here here's the ticket and also there's an ant pass if you go over here there should be a free ant pass right here free ant pass like it's right behind the ant thing right behind the ant battle area like see there's the ant box and then right behind it is that royal jelly okay now well actually since we're here let's do the one inside of this area in here there's a glitter there's a glitter behind the gummy boots why why isn't it there we go finally it worked okay but anyways there's a star jelly right up here right in front of gummy bear and there is a glitter behind the gummy boots as you can see See, it's kind of faint because I already collected it, but it's right there. And now here's another really simple one. It's right above Mother Bear. So if we go over here, there's some tickets right here above Mother Bear. And you can go ahead and collect those. And I think it's five tickets, I'm pretty sure. And then if we go over to the Red HQ right here, there should be a Royal Jelly right above the portal. Do you see that? All the way up there. All the way up there. And to get there, what you're going to do is you're going to go on the portal and you're going to jump and glide around and you should be able to pick it up. It's kind of hard. It's going to take a few attempts, but you can collect it. It's right here inside the Red HQ. Another Royal jelly is if you go over here to the red cannon and you fly back see there's on it right here right next to on it is a royal jelly and then if we come over here to the ticket tent right here's the ticket tent right here is a little hole in the wall and in this hole in the wall there's like a maze of some sort there's a maze here you can go through here come around here and jelly beans see right here you just got to go through this maze and now let's go back there we go and if we go to the 15b zone right here inside of the bad shop the bad shop with the sprinklers or no, right here in the sprinkler shop there's a star jelly on top of the, uh, the, what is this? The blender? Okay, yeah, the blender. There's a star jelly right on top of the blender. And also, if we go over here into here, there's a star jelly right here in front of the, uh, what is this? Mid-tier gear, I guess. Right in front of the mid-tier gear. But, uh, yeah, there's a star jelly right in front of the mid-tier gear. Also, if we go over here, we go all the way up to these clouds right here, this cloud parkour. We can go ahead, hop on up here, and we will find ourselves this royal jelly on top of the pine tree over here. So, we've just got to do all this. And here we are. Royal jelly on top of the pine tree. While we're up here, there is also, upon uh, upon completing this moon parkour, right in front of the diamond mask, there's some more glitter for you. But here's the diamond mask. Let's go equip that for no reason. I mean, good old times when I was a blue hive, you know? There's this, there's a royal jelly right here, uh, right below the, like, red little spiky thing. Right here, there's a royal jelly, but you can't collect it. You should be able to walk through, but you can't. There's glass in front of it. It's a little invisible wall. Now, to get that, what you need to do... Ooh, wait, I have a panda bear quest. Or no, sorry, it's a polar bear quest. But yeah, what you got to do is you got to come up to the mountaintop and you've got to jump down here and behind here right underneath the instant converter on top of it and behind the meteors you can go back here and there's a little hole in the wall that you can just walk straight into just keep walking straight forward and you should be able to get the royal jelly right here see boom i'm just gonna reset so i can get to my hive quicker all right but anyways there's another thing over here in the red hq again it is right up here it is a royal jelly next to the strawberry dispenser let's go ahead and use that actually get some free strawberries but yeah there's a royal jelly right on the red hq and if we go over here to the blue hq right over here blue hq if we go upstairs in the blue hq to right here there is a royal jelly we can collect and right over here there is a micro converter and also there's this digital b thing that you got to complete and right in here should be a star jelly you can get a star jelly from in here uh but you got to complete the digital b event thing now if you go inside the 35 b zone you can go over here to the like the pedal shop with the white hive leaderboards and stuff like that right behind here if you just keep walking straight forward you can go behind the 
the shop and you're in here now and you can go ahead walk into here and you can collect the star jelly from right down here i don't know what's beyond here oh oh i know i know i know right beyond here is that maze with the jelly beans um but you can't get through i guess it's like a little taunting thing that star jelly right there and then up here in the coconut tree right here there is coconuts right there do you see those hold on um let me just see if i can yep right here there is some coconuts you can go ahead go up here and grab those and after you defeat the coconut crab behind the coconut crab's cave in here like you know with all the coconut gear and stuff right up here if you jump on the coconut dispenser which let's go ahead and use that if you jump over it you can go in here and there should be a ticket jelly beans and enzymes and you can collect all of those and over here by the rose field there is a royal jelly right here so you can go ahead and collect this and now here's where the golden egg is this is a golden egg right over here it is let's defeat this werewolf real quick actually there we go right behind here is a golden egg but you're gonna need some haste because there are these things called cave monsters guarding it so you run into the werewolf cave you run you run you run you run and there's a golden egg right here and you can go ahead and collect it and i just died to the cave monster see that thing look at those those are scary and right on the ticket tent here there is another royal jelly and up here on top of the mountain mountain gear shop right here is a royal jelly right there and then up here as you can see there is a free ticket so you go over here you jump off this spike right here and you can go ahead and collect yourself this ticket over here there is another free ticket on the ledge of the mountain right here on this rock there is a free ticket up there and also there are some free pineapples behind this pineapple right here you can go ahead and collect those and there's some free glue right here behind this pineapple see right here behind the stump field or well in front of the stump field my bad behind the pineapple in front of the stump field is some glue so you can go ahead and collect this as well if we head over here to the star hall again inside of the star hall you'll find all like the the star amulets and stuff but actually if you check behind the supreme star amulet there is actually a free ant pass right here so you can go ahead and collect this there's a free ant pass right behind the supreme star amulet let's actually go ahead and make a supreme star amulet and we got nothing of course oh it's nighttime is there a spike anywhere hold on let's see if there's a spike anywhere i don't think there is one hopefully there is because i'm low on stingers and i can't boost till i get about 60 stingers i need 62 stingers then i can do a boost so i'm just gonna don't mind me i'm just gonna quickly do a sweep over the area gonna find myself some stingers here i don't see any all right well that's unfortunate anyways while we're here there is actually some cloud vials right here there's a free cloud vial right next to the wind shrine in the 35b zone you can go ahead and collect this if we head over here to the noob bear shop right here behind the club dispenser there is a little pocket right here that you can jump into and there's some parkour here but before you do the parkour don't miss this but there's a ticket right here you can collect this ticket right here right in front of this little window here i don't know why this window is here but yeah, you can do but yeah you can do this parkour and you can jump across jump across and then right here right here hold on let's let's get over here actually um okay there we go right here we can go ahead and collect this free royal jelly which is right on the roof of the noob bear shop right here see that's also where you get the demon mask by the way now if we jump up here all the way over here to the what is this the mediocre bear shop i guess <laughs> the mediocre bear shop in here what, what is he called oh the pro bear pro bear shop if you're in the pro bear shop there is some hidden stuff in here so if you go behind pro bear and behind the parachute little board thing back here is a little maze again and you can complete this maze and there's some stuff in here let's go ahead and complete this maze it's right through here okay hold on i'm gonna redo this for you guys that way it makes more sense for you guys so you can run through here all the way straight forward take a right and then you take a right again and then you take a right again and then again and then again there should be some sunflower seeds as you can see right there some sunflower seeds for you and now if we head over here to the 5b gate right here in this little pocket in the side of the ramp there are some tickets right here for you so you can go ahead and collect those also if we go back to the werewolf place let's quickly run up to the werewolf place right here see this pumpkin right here this pumpkin behind it is actually a free royal jelly so you can go ahead hop behind this pumpkin and right here is a free royal jelly and then last but not least there is a free diamond egg right in here in the 30b gate zone there is a free free diamond egg right below on its lid so if we go down here right down here there is a free diamond egg right in front of this dancing bear right here so if we hop down here we can go ahead and 
see there is a free diamond egg right here. And also, if we go back to the 30B gate zone, on the side, the left side of when you enter the 30B gate, on the left side of it, there should be some tickets right here waiting for you. And also, whenever it's nighttime, see these moons right here? These moons will all light up and you can jump on them. But right now, since they're see-through, we can't jump on them. Otherwise, we'll just fall right through them. But yeah, once you finish this parkour here, there's a royal jelly right there all the way up at the top next to BBM or Bubble Bee Man. Now, if we go back over to the red cannon right over here, let's go ahead and use the red cannon. And if we go back to the pineapple patch, which is right here on top of this pineapple right here, so we can go over here, get on top of this little blue spike thing on the uh, 30, 30B gate. If we go onto this blue spike, we can go ahead, run across it, and we can jump over here onto the top of this pineapple. And there should be some tickets inside the top of this pineapple. And uh, yeah, with all that said, that's every single hidden item location, every little secret item that you can get. You can get a free diamond egg, a free gold egg. I, I'd say these are these are pretty worth it. You can get some star jelly as well. And uh, yeah, with all that said, this is the end of the video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you all in the next Roblox Bee Swarm Simulator video or any other video I publish. Goodbye!